Thank you for welcome to another episode of Field of Play. It's your boy Ellie, and today I'm happy to welcome you to the first episode of the year 2024. And as you know, African Cup of Nations is just around the corner. Kindly remember to subscribe to all our social media platforms at Field of Play GH on YouTube, Instagram, TikTok, and Facebook. When we come back, I'll give you some details of the African Cup of Nations, which is going to happen on the 13th of January. Stay tuned, don't go anywhere, we'll be right back. Hi people, welcome back. So the African Cup of Nations is in a few days. It's in on the 13th of January happening at Cote d'Ivoire. And Ghana and other African countries have made their way. All the African teams have now arrived. And today I want us to have a look at the top five teams who dressed nice for their arrival. So we start from the sit, then we go to the one, and then you can tell me which one you think really dressed nicely. I like it when African countries dress to represent their culture and their their history. Uh, Ghana did it at the at, at Qatar 2022 and it was very exciting. They wore the smoke. This time around they wore something very different. So let's start with the sixth African country that represented at Cote d'Ivoire on the arrival and what they were wearing. Let's have a look at the country. Now we're looking at Namibia. People are making fun of them because of the colors and how they are tailor so the outfit. But I think it was pretty cool. And if you know the country and their flag, you can see they wanted to pick colors from their national flag. So it's, it's, it's pretty cool. It's pretty decent, even though it's not funky. All right, so let's look at the fifth country that arrived in style, should I say, Egypt and Morocco. They pretty much had similar outfits. I mean, they just had a simple jacket, but in terms of the designs and pattern, in the jacket i think was very decent this is something i could see myself wearing to an event or wearing outside to hang out with friends and stuff like that so it was pretty urban and pretty decent and very very neat even though we know history and morocco have a very rich culture they didn't want to put or they didn't put that on display in this particular tournament or on their arrival now the fourth country that we are going to look at is Nigeria. Now, Nigeria came out pretty looking decent. They came out in their white and in green. They had green patterns and they had their traditional hats. I mean, they were looking very, very decent and pretty, pretty neat. I mean, it was very simple, minimal, but very, very, very classy. The third country that we're going to look at is Mauritania. They came in with a green pattern outfit. It looked very, very, very simple and very, very, very neat and very elegant. I mean, all the teams were dressed in this and it was astounding. And I, I really loved it. And I, I thought it was very, very, very nice. And it came out very good. I mean, let's let's give it out to them. We hope they perform very well, even though they've dressed, though they've dressed very good. We hope it reflects in their performance. So let's look at the second team. I mean, Guinea-Bissau here, to me, wore a very pretty decent outfit for the arrival they had a traditional uh, i don't know what they call it agbala or agbada or something it looked very nice and they had two options they had the black one and a, a deeper blue one and then they had a, a lighter blue one which looked very 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 nice in all their team and group pictures now to my favorite one is the ghana national team who wore beautiful kente uh, fabric or in terms of cloth i mean with a white uh, jumper inside like the way the airways do i mean they look very decent and the guys look very majestic the only thing missing was the crown and some african jewelries in terms of gold or beads or something to complement it but they look very decent and we hope all these transforms or translates into performance on the page at the end of the day all right people so thank you so much for watching today's episode of further play we will be bringing you all the episodes of the african cup of nation we'll bring you stories and everything that goes around the afcon my name is ellie kindly remember to subscribe to all our social media platforms from my field of play gh on youtube instagram tiktok and facebook see you on the next one bye bye